Microcontroller is a device that is used for or that is programmed and can be used for basic input output functions in other words let's say if the input is this then the output switches on or off or it can be used to do processing in more advanced devices with reference to timing data sorting as well as self-maintenance and troubleshooting or for devices in communication. As a result, they are ideal for the use in keyboards, computer mouses, telephone, watches and other timing devices, home appliances, digital cameras, as well as remote controls. Difference between a microcontroller and a microprocessor. Microcontroller Microcontroller consists of a CPU central processing unit RAM ROM input and output peripherals and it can be programmed to calculate and perform a wide range of tasks it also has internal clock whereas the microprocessor does not have most of these aspects. It consists of a CPU and an internal clock unit. As a result, it is primarily used for processing, whereas the controller has the RAM and the ROM so it has a wider range of functionality however the processor because it does not have all these other aspects it needs to be added separately and the processor because it doesn't have all those aspects has the ability to operate at much higher clock speeds microprocessor can perform multiple tasks whereas the microcontroller can only be programmed to perform a single task discrete logic discrete logic or discrete circuits uses aspects and components like transistors resistors and capacitors to create a circuit which in the end will serve a specific purpose as computers are large and overall circuits are larger, the power can increase and they tend to be less susceptible to electronic interference. Integrated logic. Integrated logic or integrated circuits are smaller. Uh, they are IC based as a result they require less power to operate uh, because of the smaller distances between the onboard components 
In other words, the transistors, resistors and capacitors that's internal on the IC because they are so close together. Switching times decrease. However, the possibility of electronic interference is always a relevant issue.